a multi-state manhunt centered here in Metro Detroit. Police believe that's where two suspected killers are hiding right now. 7 Action News reporter Anne Marie LaFlame has this week's Detroit's Most Wanted. A murder in West Virginia, but police quickly uncover both suspects and the victim are from the Detroit area. So they've called the U.S. Marshals and now they're asking for your help to put two men behind bars. Katwan Gray and Devin Graham murdered Julius Jenkins in cold blood. The U.S. Marshals say 40-year-old Detroit native Julius Jenkins was killed in this West Virginia alley in November. These two young men shot the poor victim execution style and then fled like cowards. His body wasn't discovered until the next day. And that's when police say they discovered the men responsible are from the Detroit area as well. This has made major news in Huntington, West Virginia. This murder, you know, has rocked the community and the fact that it's people from our neighborhoods going down there committing murder and then coming back to our neighborhoods. We can't have that. Both men are in their early 20s and believed to have returned home to hide. They have nothing to lose and that is why the viewer tips that we receive, the information that comes from the public is so crucial because that allows us to make an apprehension safely. Katwan Gray is from Detroit's west side. He's 5'10", 240 pounds, and police believe he pulled the trigger. If you would do that to somebody that you know, no nothing stands in front of this person from hurting other people. And that's really the, the issue, is he is a danger to the community. Devin Graham is from Warren. He's 6'3", 175 pounds. The marshals believe family here in Metro Detroit are helping the two hide. If you're willing to kill, you're willing to do anything, and we're going to put you behind bars. And as always, if you have any information on where Gray or Graham may be, call the U.S. Marshals anytime at 313-234-5656. There is a cash reward being offered. I'm Anne-Marie LaFlame, 7 Action News.